hello everyone this is asmr today welcoming you to my new photoshop tutorial and today i'll show you the instagram pop-up photos so how to do that this type of things i'll make it like that so this one i just given the post in my facebook page and today i'll show you how to make it and step by step as well so at first you have to do uh, go to your phone to your phone and take the snapshot of instagram this one is my instagram profile and suppose i choose this post and i took a snapshot by using the volume brokers yeah iphone and after that i saved it out just mail this photo and i got this photo this one this one my snapshot and i'll use this one for this tutorial so at first i'll go to the file so go to the file and take a new and from here i'll take a canvas which is 2560 and 1440 and pixel 200 pixel per inch and hit the create button you'll get a white background canvas or artboard whatever you can tell and go to the file and place embedded options from here i got download this stock image i'll give you that stock image download link in my video description so fit this one with your screen and like that okay so after that go to the file and place embedded from here i'll take this snapshot suppose this one or this one whatever you want so i'll take this one at first so and then i'll remove this portion so how to do that at first go to the right press and restylize the layer and and then go to the rectangular market tool and select this portion and fill it white like that so choose or pick the color from here and press alter delete it will be white color and press ctrl d for the deselect you are getting the white type background so after that press ctrl t and make it smaller like that yeah that's fine that's good and hit the tick button and after that i'll draw a rectangle or other stuff so you have to make the perspective like uh, the curve type so press ctrl t and right press and go to the perspective and press the shift and alter button and make it like this little bit yeah that's fine so place over here that's good and hit the tick button and now i'll draw a rectangle so go to the shape tool and take a rectangle like that so i'll take rectangle or draw rectangle according to this so that's good and i'll make it the uh, ash color and i'll place a uh, image over here so press ctrl t and again go to the perspective and press the shift and alter button and match the perspective according to the window that i'll draw a line or rectangle over here so i'll select here and take a new blank layer and go to the rectangle and choose the rectangle color that is the black color and select like that yeah that's fine and you have to match with this so press ctrl t and select this one like this yeah that's fine and go to the lower portion and you have to match with this screen and hit the tick button so it is making like a, a depth or like this one is a layer or this one is a the thick layer like that so take a new blank layer again and go to the black color and go to the brush tool and select once press ctrl t and give the shadow in a downside of the window so you can make it like this or like this yeah that's fine and hit okay so you can adjust the opacity from here yeah that's fine you can adjust with that yeah that's good and now i'll use this area so how to do that go to the file and place embedded options and 
just get a image i'll download this image from the uh, pixels.com i'll give you that download link over here so i'll adjust this one you can down the opacity and you will get the portion where you will cut so i'll take this portion so increase the opacity and right press and just here create the clipping mask okay that's fine so now here that's good and now press ctrl j you'll get a copy of this layer so i'll use this one so how to do that go to the quick selection tool and select this model select carefully when you are selecting the model so you can use a lasso tool or whatever tool which is helping you out to select the subject properly so you can use pen tool as well i'm using here the quick selection tool it is convenient to me so you can select this one this portion a full full girl actually so this one so you can just select this portion only so select and deselect portion so for the refining process you can adjust like that go to the select options and select and mask options so here is the portion don't reduce it too much and don't make it smooth more otherwise it will be spoil or age refining that's good uh, that's fine and new layer it okay so you are getting like that the girl is jumping in this portion so now i'll add the color effects and other steps so go to the adjustment layer and go to the gradient map and select this gradient and that is the violet and orange and i'll change the color that is like blue type color or aqua type color that's good and hit okay and hit okay and make the blending mode into soft light yeah that's fine and then go to the adjustment layer again and go to the solid color and take the solid color like uh, this and hit okay and make it soft light and i'll make it a little bit like this yeah that's fine and select all the layers make it group and make it merge so after that go to the filter and nick collection color effects pro and from here i'll add another effects you know color fix pro is a uh, plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link you can go to my video description you'll get the download link over there from here i'm using the cross processing and here are lots of filters which one is perfect for Im your image you can choose it out and you can do that so i'll select here and hit ok it's taking time to load it up and give you the final output and it will be amazing for you so you're getting like a popped up instagram post so this one is a technique and this one is easy hope that you learn a lot from this video if you did please thumbs up and share with your friend and don't forget to subscribe and sh share my videos and don't forget to press the bell icon for the new notifications when i'll publish my videos or video tutorials so until the next video i am asm signing out today and bye bye